welcome to Harold's Place. This week we're going to discuss the very important topic of everyday movie situations. Have you ever had anything like that happen to you, Albert? Yes. This has happened to me before. Would you care to tell me about it? In old country, women need to do things, and sometimes women cannot do things, so they must become a man. Just might be in a movie. <laughs> it's all getting a little bit sick, you know? And I'll be in my room just trying to hang out. Someone always comes a knocking. <laughs> never see you anymore. Come out the door, it's like you've gone away. We used to be best roomies, now we're not. Wish you would tell me why. Do you want to make a movie? Doesn't have to be a movie. Go away, Carol. Okay, bye. So you finally start to feel better. Then your roommate asks you to do dumb stuff, like this. No, it's gonna go. Hey, Carol. Hey. Catch that. <laughs> and next thing you know, you'd be lying in bed and this happens. I also like to travel the world. I can show you the world. Champion shimmering splendor. Honey princess, now when you last let your heart decide. I can open your eyes. Take you under my wonder. Over sideways and under on a Carpet like a whole new world. New fantastic point of view. You don't want to tell us no or where to go. Say the real thing. New world. And then there's those moments when your roommate decides to do an awkward art project. Paint me like one of your hockey girls. Okay. Darn it, I want to be paint. I have an idea! Can you paint with all the colors of the wind? Carol? Yeah? Are you still going to make that casserole? Yeah. B, C, F, F. So two of Harold's Place. Woo! Hopefully movies run your life as much as they run ours. <laughs> Jack.
Just so you know, Carol's painting of me as a hockey girl is on sale, but it opens now. <laughs> <laughs> Do you hear that? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>